Hello guys, welcome back to Ten of Things. Well, for today's video, we are going to show you or discuss with you how to fix Samsung Smart Switch not compatible. So, if you're having problems with your Samsung Smart Switch here, oh, well, there are a few things here that you may want to do. So, first things first is you may want to clear the data or local data for your Smart or Smart Switch app. So, you want to go and open up your settings here, and you want to scroll down a bit here, look for apps. Go and open it up. And in the app section, you want to go and just scroll down over here until you see Smart Switch. Go ahead and open it up. And in here, you should see a bunch of things. So that includes notifications, screen time. You could also set this as a default for a certain, uh, certain uh, processes. But what's important here is going to be uh, the storage section. So you may need to scroll down a bit here in order for you to see it. But in the storage here, you may want to click on the clear cache first at the bottom right. So see if that works. And if it does not work for you, go and choose the clear data on the uh, bottom left here and see if that actually helps. Now, uh, also when you go back uh, into one page here in the Smart Switch app, you may want to go to permissions and you may want to allow permission for certain connectivity, like for example, for your contacts, call logs, calendars, or like Wi-Fi connection. So make sure to allow permissions, necessary permissions for the Smart Switch here or for it to work properly. And the last thing that you could try doing here is to just uninstall the app. Sometimes uninstalling and reinstalling it again can help a lot. So if uh, if you if if you notice that there's an update first, go ahead and try updating it. But if it does not update, go ahead and just uninstall and reinstall again. But that's about it. Hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to NFT Inspo. Thank you for watching.